Hey guys, how's it going? It's Darth Maul 516 here. And today, as the title suggests, we are doing a first person only challenge for our gameplay. I'm going to show a game on Battlefront 1 and Battlefront 2 today. So I'm keen to do that for you guys. So let's go ahead and find ourselves a game for Battlefront 1 first. And I'll see you guys there. Okay, here we are guys on Rebel Base. Um, I did just play a game as the Imperials last game and my team got actually belted because you know, I didn't have the best team in the world, but that's not going to stop me from making a game. I'm only doing it this match as opposed to last one because I wanted to use the DL-18 as the Rebels for this because that's like my favourite gun and I've never done first person before so I'm really keen to give this a go. Maybe down the future I'll probably do it without the HUD. If let's be screen, that'd be good. Oh, cool. The rolling third person. Okay, this is, uh, this is interesting. Let's go find someone to kill in a thing. This might take me a few minutes to really get used to, guys. Um, I never played first person in the first place because it feels too much like, it felt too much like Call of Duty for me. And that's the last thing I wanted this game to be for me, so... Oh, that's a good start. Okay. I don't mind the fact that the rolling is actually third person for you, so that's quite uh, interesting. Okay, not too bad. When I eventually, maybe down the track, I might try and actually do this with... Oh. Um, yeah, I might try and do this with no HUD in the future, actually. Like, it's first person, no HUD, but I just really want to get this a go. So, as you guys know, the DL-18 is my favourite gun. And I actually saw this come up on someone else's channel, so I was actually... ...really keen to try it out for myself. Ah, damn it. Unlucky. Okay, not, not bad of a start. We've secured the cargo. And look, I saw a few comments in some of my latest videos that you guys wanted more commentary videos, so I really appreciate that. I do enjoy doing them. It's just as of late, I've had a few really good HVV games where I wasn't recording, but I wanted to upload them, because they were actually pretty good. I got like spawn protection. So yeah, that's the main reason for that. I do have... Um, I do have a Han Solo one coming that I, I just had a really good game about half an hour ago, maybe an hour ago now. So that's coming. There is going to be a Boba Fett game I played as well that I really enjoyed. So those two will come up. I'll get shot. And, um... Oh, damn it. Yeah, and there's also a, uh... Sorry, I lost my train of thought, guys. Um, there is going to be a funny moments video coming up. Um, I was in a Galactic Assault game last night with a few friends, and the lobby was dead, so we're just trolling around. But I just have to edit that before that comes up, so stay tuned for that and the future HV uploads. But there, there is definitely going to be some more um, commentary cam no, com commentary videos coming. I do have some plans, so don't go away, guys. So stay tuned for more videos and please turn on notifications so you can actually watch them. So yeah, that's what I wanted to quickly say about that. Oh, shot. I've got to admit, I really am enjoying this first person though. Like, to see it with my favourite gun is quite a unique sight. See, so yeah, um, I was going to upload a Yoda game as well, but you guys already saw the 39 elimination, so... Unless it beats that, I don't think you really need to see anything for a while, so... So for now, you guys don't need to worry about that. So yeah, it's just going to be that Han Solo game I played, that Boba one that I recorded a few days ago. Obviously no audio, because um, I didn't plan those matches that were good, it kind of just happened really. So, oh, that's where I'm getting shot from. So yeah, as I said, it's just the Han Solo game and the Boba game. That funny moments one. I'm just going to put music over it. Because the friends I was in a party with, they don't have their um, like voice approved in the, like the party settings. So I'm just going to put music over the clip. But it's still funny nonetheless though. So those three are coming. And then some more commentary videos that I've actually planned will be coming as well. So that's what I wanted to round about, guys, in this video. So... 
yeah, stay tuned for that. But anyways, um, I'm on a bit of a little death straight because I've been distracted, so let's continue to get things popping here in this first person mode. It's a lot different, especially in, in plays like that, full on rolling past you. Okay, I started alright, but now I'm, I lost a bit of momentum here. Look, I don't expect this to go overly well, I mean, I've never done this before on this game mode. Yeah, that's nice. Now I'm pretty sure there is someone else around the corner. It smells good, but yeah, there it is. I, I don't remember which good bro that is, but I'm, I'm pretty sure it's someone I've played with before, I just don't fully remember. But yeah, I want to try and get a little bit of a like, kill streak here, like a few kills in a row without dying, so let's see if I can get that done. Uh, oh, damn. D didn't expect him to show up, and then he did. Oh, okay, hello. Where'd he go? See, that's the problem with um, first person, is like, I don't know if they're behind me or not. <sighs> For God's sake. This smells good, bro, it's really annoying. The weird thing is that last game we started bad and the next minute he's playing like that. I'm like, does someone like is someone else playing the game now? As opposed to who I was before, or was he just off? I don't know. But look, I'm, I don't know how well this is gonna go, unfortunately. Stormtroopers have the cover. But look, it's not necessarily for these tribes of challenge videos, it's not necessarily about going all on domination or anything like that. It's more just actually trying something different. that guy off. Ah, oh, for God's sake. Yeah, he's going to keep beating me with this as long as I'm first person, because I'm not used to it, and he's just going all out. That's okay. Um, okay, he's probably going to be up there, so I'd, I'd be surprised if he ends up killing all of them. He's obviously still up there. He's up here somewhere. If anything, yeah, he's about to pick him off. I got some payback. <laughs> Good job with the emotes. Alright, let's bring you home with this cargo, eh? Oh, quick, go, 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 cap it. Nice, secure. good stuff. Okay, at least I'm not going bad, overly bad negative, so that's not too bad. Oh, come on. I was about to shoot that time down. Yeah, at least I'm not playing too, too bad, so that's alright. My partner doesn't help things, so he's only got like one kill. Now I'm getting flanked too, come on. That's the problem with third person. I can't tell who's behind me. It's like, for this type of game mode, when people are really rolling around like that, I feel like it's going to really hinder um, your peripheral vision, because you do rely on the third, third person view to actually see your enemies, you know? But look, I'm not too bad, like, I'm not, I'm not doing too bad at all. It's just in terms of my surroundings, like, it's a bit hard to be fully aware. So that's something I've already picked up on. Gotcha. Ah, that was good. That was good from Darth Maul. I'm finding the pulse cannons to be a lot easier than actually shooting the gun for this. Because it already shoots straight for you as long as you're aiming. So I've got that one as well. So that's pretty good. Oh, where'd that guy go? Okay, we traded. Not bad. Okay, I'm doing alright. I want to see if I can try and cut down on the deaths for the last five or six minutes or so. Let's see what I can do. I mean, I am really enjoying this first person though, so... I don't think that I'm not enjoying this, because I really am, to be honest. Oh, damn, that missed him. Okay, not bad. Now they got the cargo. Sprint, sprints, damn it. Damn it. Got him. Not bad. I'm going to just make someone else get some for the cargo. Yeah, smells good, bro. That's exactly who it is. Along with a few other mates. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, I'm not doing too bad. I'm getting a few more kills now. So I think I am starting to get used to it. 
I'm actually interested to see how Battlefront 2 is going to look with it. I mean, obviously pretty similar, but... I, mean, I am keen. Oh, okay, that was a bad jump. It's a pity that it's the inside mount, because I wanted to try jump shots, but... If I eventually do a no hard one, I might give that a go, so... Next time around, I might try it. Oh, Jesus. I'm glad didn't see him there. Oh, nice smart rocket partner. Ah, oh, damn it. That guy's always using explosive shot every time I come across him. Some people just don't change, do they? Then again, I use this gun a lot, so I guess I'm in a sense I can't talk. Look, I'm actually, I actually want you, some of you guys for yourselves to actually try this out, because I, I think this is a really fun challenge. The cargo is in our hands. Escorted back to base. It's not too bad. I mean, up close, it's not too bad to aim because you know they're just right in your face. And I guess, in a sense, I do have the um, Call of Duty experience to fall back on because you know I think it, most people use first person on that game, so it's not like I'm completely useless doing this. Oh, that guy just one died. Is there anyone else there? Oh, back there, there is, but I want to get a shot off. Imperial forces their cargo. Yeah, straight after this, I am going to Battlefront 2 for the first person, so please don't go anywhere, guys. Um, I'm going to avenge my partner now. Ah. Yep, yeah, emote. No offense, Shaden, but if you knew I was doing first person, you probably wouldn't laugh so much. So how many people actually would have the courage to do this type of thing? Like, it's not something you see very often. Come on, laugh again. Yep. I'm playing the party with her and she always laughs and teabags me. It's, at times it can be annoying, but, you know, I guess you can't change what people are like. Let's, clear the out of here. <laughs> Let's give it back. <laughs> yeah, even though I'm first person, I'm not going to back down, so... Damn it. Oh, nice shot. You must have got a headshot, that guy. Okay, look, I know I've died 20 times, but it's not too bad, I guess. I mean, it could be worse. This, my main ob objective here is to actually stay positive. Whoa, okay, you must have just landed in the trip mine there. <laughs> well, at least my team are doing the objective well, so I'm just positive. Nice guys, nice. Alright, we've got some enemies, so let's stay sharp here. Gonna eat your emote yeah, because you know just it's just emotes, I mean it's not the worst thing in the world. Okay, I'm not doing too bad. I mean this last five minutes or so I've actually died only a few times, so it's actually not too bad. Yeah, I can't get a shot up there. Alright, if we can get a draw, that's a pretty good result, considering I haven't really played the objective as much. Alright, that's okay. Okay, not too shabby. Alright, the fact that I've got 32 kills in first person, I'm pretty impressed with myself in that regard, so... Good on me there. But obviously, dying 20 times is to be expected for something that it's your first time in, so... Almost, yeah, he's probably going to run a regen. Uh, I might stick in this door for a second. Oh, barrel, I'll just get back. This, damn it, yeah, I was always going to miss that. Ah, uh, you copied me with my gun. Look, I have to admit, although I don't like explosive shot, it's really good with that gun there, like, in terms of its cooling power. So, if anyone wants to try that in your own time, feel free. So, that's something that... Because I used to do it in HVV, so I am familiar with that concept. Okay, three on one. I'm not going to be able to do much here. I'm going to need some help. Someone there? Yeah. yeah, he's always going to pick me off then. Because of the camera angle, he, like, they know when the, like when their opening is. And players like that aren't dumb, so... Alright. Let's try and get a few more kills in this last minute. What is that explosive shot? Oh, oh, that was a bad shot. 
Actually, thank God I have skin. Huh? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's still there. I think there is in that corner. Jesus, man, it's terrible. Oh, yeah. Jeez, all right. That was pretty bad from you boys off all there, guys. Oh, so was that. Yeah, so, like, my personal opinion so far is obviously, like, your, wor your surroundings, like, from, like, your rear and um, your sides is a bit hindered, but overall, it is not too bad. Our cargo box is safe. Okay. Alright, that's probably going to be my score, and that's the end of the game. Unfortunately, we lost that one, but, look, I still got 34 kills in first person, so I'm pretty happy with that. Very happy with that. Anyways, guys, I'm going to find a game for Battlefront 2 now, so I'll see you all there in a few minutes. Okay guys, here we are on the Battlefront 2 menus. Now before I search for a game, I'm just going to let you know that it is going to be Blast that we're playing, because I don't want the temptation of using heroes, and I'm going to maybe try and avoid Enforcers, and that, maybe it depends how we go, because I want, I want to see what the jump pack mechanics like and all that type of thing. So anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Alrighty guys, here we are on Taco Dana. Um, we haven't joined too late, so I'm just going to play this game out. But before I do that, I am going to have it first person, so that should do it. Um, okay, I'm going to go with the officer as usual. Let's get things popping, guys. Okay. Okay, so the battle command bit is third person. Okay, the roll's not. Which is nice. It's different to Battlefront 1. Oh, I'm dead already. Different to Battlefront 1 is the roll in there, which briefly shows the third person. Now, if I can get enough battle points, I am going to try out maybe a like aerial class just to see what it's like with the jump mechanic. Whether it's, it's, it's uh, sorry, whether it's third person through the um, through the flight or whether it's first person through the flight, because obviously as you guys saw, it, it was first person briefly when jumping, so I want to see what that looks like. Now the round only got the top, so I want to get a few kills, because obviously that's the easiest way to earn some battle points, is to in fact stay alive, so. Sorry if it seems like I'm walking slow by the way, um, sometimes I have problems with my stick in terms of um, sprinting, so that's, it is annoying at times. Oh damn, that guy stole that kill. And he didn't quite get my battle command, but hopefully my officer's presence does help him out. But I really need to get a few kills, because the other team has the edge, so I don't want this game to end, end too quickly. Oh my god. Alright, I'm really having a bad start here, guys, so I really need to try and have a good solid few minutes here. Um... Obviously, as I've said before, um, your awareness, like in terms of um, other directions of you, is very hindered because you can only see what's on the screen. So, but that's what first person is supposed to be like. Now it's a time. Okay, I don't. Thank God that's gone. So I didn't want to waste my shots on it. I missed one. There we go. All right, Darth Maul's on the board. All right, let's keep it going, guys. I think, until I get used to this for another minute, so I'm going to try and maybe go inside. Okay. Obviously that's first person as well. Not surprising, because anything you throw is generally um, first person. Oh, why did I turn around? I would have seen him too. Um, okay, that was... I think I do have enough already for the aerial, but I want to try and for a few more minutes just to do this before the game ends. Because obviously you can see that this match is reasonably one-sided and I don't think my team's going to win this one. Alright, here's another kill. Alright, that Wookiee's going to be hard to take down, so let's go for this officer right here. Lay it up. Okay, not too shabby, not too shabby. Um, okay, don't know where anyone is, but I don't really want to stand around, so... Oh, hello! Why has I said that? If I stood there a little longer, I could have picked him off. Um, Okay, at the rate of this, I might play one more life, or two, and then try the aerial out. Yeah, that's a nice spawn. So obviously this is pretty one-sided, but... Yeah, I am debating whether to give another game for you guys, but... Um, I think you guys kind of get the idea, especially since... 
I did play first person on Battlefront already. My well, Battlefront 1, that is. That's a time. Okay, let's get back there. I'm gonna jump down so I can actually shoot him. Oh, got him outnumbered. Okay, got one. Okay, that guy's lagging, but I got shot from mine. Alright, I'm not doing too bad. Um, yeah, I ain't gonna go to the aerial now, because this match is really one sided, so. Uh. Oh, okay, is there not a first person for this? Um, I guess there might not be. So, obviously, that effect. For the entirety of the video, I'm gonna respawn here. Okay, either it's something on my settings that changed, or there actually is no first person view. Okay, alright. I'm back in first person view here, so there must not be one for the aerial. I must say, I'm a tad disappointed, but it would have been pretty cool to see how that works. But I guess it is what it is, right? And this is a first person video, so I'm not going to go playing um, third person as an aerial. So, obviously this game is going to end soon, so I'm going to see if I can get a few more kills for you guys. Um, look, I'm probably going to end the video after this match, as obviously this is pretty one-sided, and let's face it, who wants to see a very one-sided match, usually, on YouTube? If you're doing a stream, that'd be different circumstances, but... Oh, damn it. Yeah, you guys can easily tell how the first person works, but... It's basically just like, in some degree, it's like playing Call of Duty, because my assumption is most people play first person for that. Yeah, let's help him get that one. Alright, come on, please get him first. I don't mind the officer's presence being third person, so that's not too bad. Let's get a few on him. Oh, God, there's another Wookiee. How many of these Wookiees are there? Ah, oh, far out. Yeah, see, this is why I want to end it here, because it's very one-sided. But, alright, let's try and get one more quick kill to end this one. I'll always end on a good note. A rule that Darth Maul likes to have. And if I do lose a game, I don't like to make it too easy for the other opposition. Oh, damn. I didn't get one in time. Unfortunately, that must be the case, because obviously you can see there how one-sided that was, but... As I said, I think you guys get the idea for first person. So, that is going to do it for our video today, guys. As always, thanks again for watching. Be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications for more content. Thank you all again, and I'll see you in my next video, guys. May the force be with you.